Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your Twitter account private. So there's a couple of things you need to do to completely make your profile private on Twitter. I'm going to be showing you how to do this on both desktop and mobile. So first we'll start with the desktop and then we'll hop on over to our mobile device. First things first, go ahead and log into your Twitter account. Go to twitter.com slash home. And then once you're here, you'll see a few different options on the left hand side here. Go ahead under profile and go to more. So go ahead and go to more and then go to settings and privacy. Now, if you can't see all of these options here, go to your profile first and then you should see everything and then click on the more option and then settings and privacy. Under settings and privacy here, you want to navigate to the third or fourth option down privacy and safety. And then once here, you're going to want to do a few different things. The first thing you want to do is under audience and tagging. You want to click on audience and tagging. And then right here where it says protect your tweets, go ahead and check that box. It says this will make them visible only to your Twitter followers. This is the first step to making your account private. Go ahead and click on protect there. And that will also turn photo tagging off. If you want to turn that back on, you can click on photo tagging and then this will allow people to tag you in their photos. But again, if you're trying to make your account private, you probably want that set to off. Now hop back over to the privacy and safety options here by clicking on it once more. And then you want to go to direct messages right down here. Click on direct messages. And once here, you want to go ahead and uncheck allow message requests from everyone. This will make it to folks that you don't follow, uh, are not able to send you requests and add you to group conversations. Again, another step to making your account private. Now, one more step is hop back over to privacy and safety and then go to discoverability and contacts. Go ahead and click on discoverability and contacts. And what we want to do here is go to let people who have your email address find you on Twitter and let people who have your phone number find you on Twitter. You want to go ahead and uncheck these again, hiding you and making your Twitter account private. Now, once you make these changes on your Twitter account right here, where you see my username, you should see a nice little lock right here by my username. If you've done everything correctly and made your account private, you will see a lock here by your username. All right, let's hop over to the mobile device and show you how to do it over there. All right, here we are on our mobile device. The first thing you want to do is tap on your profile image in the upper left hand corner or wherever it is to get to your profile on your mobile device that will open up the options that we see here. And then at the very bottom, we'll see something that says settings and privacy. If we tap on settings and privacy, we'll see the same options that we saw on the desktop. First thing that you want to do is go ahead and go to privacy and safety once more. And then we're going to see the same things here that say audience and tagging. Go ahead and tap on audience and tagging and then just go ahead and check that protect your tweets option there and turn photo tagging off like we did previously. And then you can uncheck that anyone or only people who follow you uh, can tag you. So again, you probably want that turned off if you're trying to make your account private and then navigate back over to privacy and safety and then tap on direct messages and then go ahead and uncheck allow message requests from everyone. And then the last thing we want to do is hop back over to privacy and safety and then go to discoverability and contacts and just uncheck let others find you by email and phone and that will completely make your account private. Hopefully this was helpful. If it was, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. If you have any questions, please put those in the comment section down below and I will see you guys in the next video.